Hey, 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 y'all. Happy Sunday. Sunday vibes. I don't know what you guys got going on today, but I just wanted to say hey. And hey. I had a... Sorry. I had a wonderful day yesterday with my family, friends. It was just really nice to see all my cousins and eat my mom and dad's food like the food was epic like i don't think y'all really understand like i posted a video um a live yesterday which was like a recap with my friends and they was telling talking about my mom's food and my friend wasn't ready yo like <laughs> she really wasn't ready like i try to tell people like my mom and dad are just outstanding with these cookouts that they do and like nobody really understands until they actually go but it was a beautiful day and um, I hope everybody else had a beautiful day I mean I might not have been as beautiful as my day but you know <laughs> I'm just fucking with you um so today I'm chilling out you see I'm in my whole oh what up L grand rising hope you're having a good weekend I am in my whole you know relaxed Zen vibe. Hey, mm -hmm. pop. Just funny how life works, you know? I've been listening to um my tarot and stuff. And like, okay, a lot of people is like, oh, you listen to tarot, that's crazy. You listen to astrology, that's crazy. Like, yo, astrology came from Africa. So that whole, oh, don't listen to astrology, that's the devil. To... Listen. A lot of the things that we need to be listening to and paying attention to is all stuff that we've been told as children. Oh, no, that's the devil. Do your research. Most of the stuff they're saying is the devil is uh, divine. Okay? So, anyway, I've been listening to my tarot lady, and she told me that motherfuckers is out here trying to do love spells on me, and, you know, they sitting up acting like they all good but they not really good and you know i just want to say whoever is out there but hurt about me please just get your life like do what you got to do for you and focus on you because i'm definitely focused on myself and also i want to say is i'm a scorpio so i don't know what people know about astrology and zodiac signs but scorpio the sign of scorpio is the most karmically and spiritually connected so if you fuck over a scorpio i don't have to worry about anything like my god the universe my ancestors they all protect me like they all protect me i'm protected and when you're spiritually protected can't nobody touch you no matter how hard mm -hmm. they try so everybody get your mind right you know get your get your spirit right get your emotions right get in touch with yourself talk to your ancestors you know, we never talk to our ancestors. How do you think that made them feel? They done went through all this going through hell on earth for us to have what we have. And we don't speak to them. Like, you really should speak to them. Um, but I know right now in my life, divinity is around me. Angels are around me. My ancestors, you know, God is around me. I could tell. I could feel it. Not only that, but my mom been telling me since I was a child that God got his hands on me and is looking out for me. And I know that to be true because I done been in some situations where, yeah, it wasn't the best situation for me to be in safety-wise or whatever. And I've always been protected because God always is protecting me. Like, you know, sometimes you got to look at your life and look at where you've been and look at where you're at now and realize that you didn't do that by yourself. Somebody was paving the way for you and moving stuff out your way. Because I was wild, you know? I was real wild, especially when I was in high school. I was in a lot of situations that probably should have took me out. And I'm still here. So, anyway. I just wanted to say that. What's up, L? You bounced? You came? You saw? You left? <laughs> oh, God. I don't know where he at. But anyway, um, I don't know what you guys got planned for today. I'm finna sit here and do some editing for my show. I'm about to watch, binge watch this show on Netflix called um, Slasher. Yeah, I like horror movies. I like horror shit. Like, that's my shit. Um, but that cookout yesterday, that is still sitting with me. My mom really went hard in the paint with everything she made. 
it was just a lot. The only thing that sucked is it was the rain. And, like, it rained most of the day, like, off and on. But then, like, towards the end of the night, it stopped. It was cool. The sun came out. It was really beautiful. Nice to be with family and friends. So, uh, that's pretty much it. I just want to say, yo, out here in this world, focus on yourself. Just focus on yourself. Whatever comes into your life, focus on it while it's in your life. When it leaves, let that shit go. Because a lot of people be living in the past and holding on to past shit and just be tormenting themselves. Like, I don't do that. Like, whatever is meant to happen is going to happen. Whatever is meant to continue will continue. Whatever is meant to end is going to fucking end, no matter what the fuck you do. So just live your life. Love yourself. Be the best version of yourself. That's my motto. So anyway, I'll talk to y'all later. Probably check in a little bit later once more y'all are awake because 10, 13 on a Sunday is still early for some of y'all. So, bye. I am currently at my mother's house. Stuff to the brim. About to pop and just go into a food coma. Y'all want to know where my love of food comes from? comes from my mama because my mama holds it down ain't no fake meals going down over here ain't no fake desserts as a matter of fact where the, where the menu at so i can show the menu i'm about, I'm about to show y'all something i'm about to show y'all what y'all missing out on because you know if you know you know <laughs> if you don't <laughs> you lost let's look let's look at this thank you for your help no problem Yes, all this made by both of my parents. Y'all could look at it and, you know, y'all could be a little jealous. Y'all could, could salivate. My parents do it right. Like, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. I just had some peach cobbler. I had some apple pie. I had some homemade vanilla ice cream. I had a s'more. Them devil eggs was popping. That corn on the cob was slapping. First thing in the morning, 17. Oh, no, I know. Because I actually used Just saying, you know. But I've never had it Had a friend come through today, and she wasn't ready. Like, she just wasn't ready. She turned, yo, she tapped out on the floor. Like, she was like, I wasn't ready. I said, I told you how it is that my mom and my dad get together, yo. Like, you ain't leaving here now satisfied like they had brisket two different types of brisket baked beans it was just ridiculous but i hope you guys are having a good fourth of july weekend and and having love and happiness around you positive vibes and um that's it might go get me a round two on the dessert right about now so i'm gonna holler at y'all later Bye. Okay, so um, we are live on the way back to North Jersey now after being stuffed at my parents' house for a cookout. And my homegirls is in the car. And I just want them to tell y'all what they thought. Kim, go. <laughs> the food was delicious. Um, I wasn't ready. I wasn't anticipating eating so much. And you tapped out on a s'more. I did, but, but mind you, there were so many good things that came before the s'more. Like there was brisket. There was <laughs> these baked beans. Them baked there beans was, was everything. everything. With the brisket now. Yes. Brisket, dip in the, dip brisket, it in the brisket. Yes. With gravy and mushroom and barbecue. <laughs> there was barbecue chicken, spare ribs, corn, deviled eggs, potato salad. Woo! There was cornbread with corn in it. Them devil egg. Ooh. Child. So, and I had dogs and burgers. He ain't had no brown dog sauce out though. Yeah, is it in a jar or something? Yeah. Yes, oh, he, he had did. it out? It was over on the right-hand side next to the chips. Oh, uh, I ain't see it. Yeah. I didn't eat a burger though. Me either. I went straight for the big shit. And it was good. All right, Jamie. So, what about you? met all my expectations <laughs> that's what she say every every time but you've been I to agree. one of you've been to my parents cookouts before so yeah. for you and you knew what to expect you came prepared to throw that shit down I'm an old faithful participant yes yeah because i was like when we went up for our second 
our second plate, Jamie's like, oh, no, I'm not. I'm done with that. No. <laughs> oh, she done, girl. We just getting it in. And now I know. You didn't put me down on the pace yourself type. Because soon as I finish my ribs and stuff. When you came in. For the, for the second time. But, but when you saw that menu, you should have known. That you no, had to pace yourself. No, when she brought the coffee out on the tray. On the tray right? I told you my mom is the black Martha Stewart, yo. Okay, but I mean, how how more grandiose do I need to say? I gotta say what she's like a a a a angel, like a like a like a food no, angel did, or something. She, she did her thing. Both of them did their thing. Yeah, my mom though. She did her thing. <laughs> That strawberry cake was good. What like what kind of icing? It was like whipped cream it's or something. Like custard or something in the middle. I don't or something know. Like that. I don't know. But I was getting ready to be so it's not upset. Like it's like a, it's it was light. It wasn't icing. It was like cream. You mean on the outside? Well, you talking about the strawberry the strawberry um cake? That was on the top. I'm talking about in the middle. It was the same. No, that's that's not whipped cream. No, it wasn't, but it was the same as the outside and the inside was the same. It was custard, almost like a custardy kind of. I don't know, but it was good. It was fresh. It was good. And I was about to be so upset because I thought they ate my peach cobbler. I was about to be upset. And then I totally forgot she made me that fried corn. Then as soon as I opened it, here come my cousin. Yo, that's some fried corn. <laughs> I said, I don't even want it all. Yo, my cousin really thought I wouldn't scrap it for that cobbler, though. We <laughs> been scrapping for that cobbler. But he couldn't hate on me, though, because I always look out for my brother. He got a sister. They look out for each other. But anyway, I just wanted y'all to hear, not just from me, how dope my parents are and how good the food was. Because, you know, sometimes people think, oh, I'm being biased. No. That shit is the official dish, all right? The official dish. I hope y'all are having a great 4th of July weekend. It's trash. <laughs> but it probably is trash compared to what we it's just trash. experienced. Just so you know. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> I like totally forgot we were all live. <laughs> nah. It don't matter. I'm the same <laughs> either way. But anyway. I'll holler at y'all guys later. We got a two-hour ride ahead of us. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, I can cut it down to an hour and a half. Oh, no, I was waiting. Bye-bye.